Hello, this is Daniel Plays. My name is Daniel, and welcome to yet another Minecraft video in which I'm going to show you real quick how to install shaders with Iris shaders for Minecraft 1.19.4. So, to get started, what you want to do is open up your Minecraft launcher, select the latest release 1.19.4, and just click play. This will make sure Minecraft 1.19.4 is downloaded and installed to your PC. Once you've made it to the main menu, all you got to do is click quit game. Now, open up the link down below in the description, or just open up your browser. Search for how to install Iris shaders. 1.19.4 and then use the first links to shaderpacks.net which will also be down in the description once you go here it should be updated to 1.19.4 because it already is but i'm seeing a cached version but for this video it doesn't really matter so all you got to do is scroll down click this link where it says iris shaders then click download universal jar and if you can't open this or you don't see the java icon that you're supposed to see right here then what you want to do is use the links down below in the description use jar fix first if that doesn't work use the second link and then after that we should all be able to open this installer so just double click it this will open up a very large and very easy to use installer just leave it on 1.19.4 or if in the future new versions are released you could just click this and select the version that you want just leave this as is and click install if you appreciate this video then be sure to give it a thumbs up down below as well as letting me know which shader you are definitely going to use once you've installed iris shaders it should probably only take half a second now you can close this you've already installed iris shaders so now it is time to get some actual shaders and if you go to the home page you can easily find it right here it says complimentary reimagine 1.19.4 just click download complimentary shaders and you'll be taken to the download section where you click download 1.19.4 just like that you'll be taken to the official curse forge page and all you got to do is click download right here wait five seconds for the download to automatically start there we go we've just downloaded the shaders all you got to do is click show in folder make sure to drag it to the desktop because we're going to have to access it right now press windows r and that will open up the run window type in percent app data percent and click ok you'll get these folders click dot minecraft create a new folder called shader packs just like so all lowercase if you've already installed shaders before you can just use that folder now double click it to open it and then drag in any shaders that you would like to use with minecraft 1.19.4 there you go as you can see it's created an iris and sodium profile for us and now all you got to do is click play you'll get a pop-up because this is the first time you're going to play this custom version so you read this and if you do understand the risks you just tick this little box and click play so here we go, we're in Minecraft 1.19.4 slash fabric. If you go into options, video settings, you can see the shader packs right here. And then you can just click complimentary reimagine or any other shader and click apply. This will make it yellow and that means it's been applied. Now, if you create a new world, you can even use the 1.20 experimental versions just like that. Then click create new world. And even though this is probably not the best spawn ever, this looks amazing because we are playing Minecraft 1.19.4 with 1.20 features combined with beautiful complimentary reimagined shaders. That's been it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up once again. And of course, as always, I'll catch you on the next one. See ya.